Hey, Bean. How are you? <sighs> I hope you're doing really well. I just wanted to talk to you a little bit and just say that I think you're doing really good. You're doing just swell. And I hope that things are continuing to get better for you. It's been... It's been a little bit of a wild year, huh? But I have all the faith that you're going to keep doing better and better and better. Especially because I know that there's a lot of things out there that you have to offer the world. There's so many things that you could be doing, improving and accomplishing more. And it's not just things that I want. It's things that you want. I know you want to keep going. I know that you want to become the type of person that you want to be. And I think that it's really important that you keep working toward that because I believe you can. You are really amazing. And I really want you to keep going and just do better. <laughs> But I want you to think about the goals that you have. What are the things that you think you'd like to do? Is it something with your health? Is it maybe learning how to do something? Is it something else? <laughs> Becoming an ultra popular VTuber. <laughs> Yee. But, uh, oh, as if I was, but I'm glad you're here, <laughs> but I would like you to think about those things, the kind of things that really matter in your life that when you're, you know, arriving at the end of your days that you can still look back and be pretty darn happy with what you picked. Because the thing that I heard was we only get to pick the regrets in our life. So it's up to us to make sure that we pick the regrets that are as small as possible. We don't want to have the largest regrets when everything's over. And so it's really important that we all think really carefully about what it is that matters to us. Take a second and just kind of think for a little bit about what's one thing that you can do or work toward that you think would make a huge difference in your life and then see what it might take to help with that. I mean, if I wanted to be a big popular VTuber I'm not sure what that takes, really. It, I have to be here. That's one thing. What else? Well, I have to put myself out there. Okay. And maybe I need to learn a little more about things like marketing. There's a lot of stuff out there. There's so many skills and things to learn if you want to do better. And it just depends on what it is you want. Maybe you want a family. And a family would be really nice. So how do you get a family? <laughs> you start learning how to meet people. You learn how to get rejected. And that's okay. There's nothing wrong with it. It's going to happen quite a bit until you find the right one for you. <laughs> it's not going to be super fun in the meantime, but it really is important that you sort of learn these skills, talk to people, interact more, and just sort of find out what makes the world tick, especially in the areas that you are most interested in. There's so much that you have to offer this place, and it would be a real shame if the world didn't get to experience it. 
and that you didn't get to show them because maybe some fear or some other issue was keeping you from giving your best shot. I'm not sure about you, but I kind of feel like I just have this one chance. I don't think that there's another chance. The Not to sound too much like I'm saying YOLO. <laughs> Usually people say that before they do something silly. But I think it's important still to recognize that and that none of us have all the time in the world. Especially not in our lifetimes. <laughs> Maybe we can download our brains or something, but I kind of don't think that that's going to happen before we're done. And so you need to keep thinking about the things that are going to matter for you. And I really hope that you're able to at least get a little bit started and start thinking about that because I believe that you can. I believe in you. You are a good bean and I really want you to do the thing. But it requires us having to take those first steps of trying to understand and figure out what it is that we actually want. If a family's a thing, then, you know, you need to reprioritize how you're spending your time. If it's to develop some kind of an amazing skill, or maybe it's to help others. Like anything like that, you need to just start. And I think that you can. That's going to be super cool if you do. I got us a little birthday cake. And that's really just because you only get so many birthdays. But it's not supposed to make you feel depressed. I think that you have a real opportunity to make the most of the time that you have. So I hope that you do because you are unique, you're incredible, and you can do it. You just gotta search your own heart about what it is that you're after. And just don't let it slip by. It's just, I would hate to see anyone just let the time slip by just waiting for the end. I would much rather see you working, doing everything that you could to just live the most glorious life that you possibly can. Because I think you could. It just needs you to believe in yourself too. <laughs> I can only do so much. And by that I mean very little. <laughs> Sorry. But there's not really... I can't push you to do the thing that you know that you want to do. It's entirely up to you. And it can be frustrating because sometimes the only thing you can do is wait. You know, maybe you just need to figure out a way for a little bit of stability just before you can move on to the next step. I mean, sometimes if you want to advance in your job, you just have to do the job that you're doing. And someday you can get that promotion. You can move up. But 
you're still going to have to be in that position for a little while. And so you need to make sure that you use that time wisely anyway. To start learning how to do more. Take on a little more responsibility. If you want to. But you probably know better than anyone what it is you want. And so maybe start a little research. See if there's anything you can do to sort of push yourself a little bit further. Because I think that you're pretty great. And I would love it if I could see you do even more. <laughs> no pressure. Aren't you going to have any cake? It's strawberry. Well, <laughs> hopefully your goal isn't to diet right now. I brought a cake. 